Hey there, this is Ian with eTrailer. Today we're going to be looking at the 2014 Hyundai Tucson and the eTrailer trailer hitch. Let's take a look. It is going to have a matte black finish. The Kurt seems to have a little bit more of a gloss finish to it. So if you're more apt to put a matte finish on your vehicle opposed to the gloss, you'll want to look at the e-trailer option opposed to Kurt. This hitch does have a 350 pound tongue weight, 3,500 towing capacity weight. Uh, there's an option as far as a higher capacity on eTrailer.com, same eTrailer.com uh, hitch, but just a, a little bit more beefy hitch. If you're going to be doing something more than just a bike rack or small trailer, that's going to be a better option. This hitch includes a two inch receiver hole, does have a pin slide. Uh, if you need a locking pin or anything of the sort, we do have those on eTrailer.com. does include our safety chain loops here. So that way, if you're towing something that's got that, you've got the option for it as well. And from the ground to the top edge of our receiver, we've got roughly 13 inches on the nose there. So that way, uh, you kind of have an idea of whether you need a raised shank or not to get anything on the back of the vehicle properly. Another measurement we want to check is from the center of our hitch pin hole out to the edge of the fascia. I've got about five inches there of clearance. It's just something to keep in mind in case you've got a bike rack or something that will stow and fold up that it's not hitting the back of the vehicle once it's all stored away. So this install is not too difficult. I do believe it's something that could be done in about 15, 20 minutes in your driveway. But if it's not something you want to try to tackle, we do have our dealer locator that'll help find somebody that can get this on there for you. You are going to need a 17 millimeter and then a torque wrench just so we can get that all to torque spec. Let's hop right into that install. And to start this install, we're going to have four weld nuts, two on each side, that are going to hold our hardware and hold this hitch in place. Let's take a look at the location of those holes. Here on the right side, we've got two of the holes. What I'm going to do is just take a little brake clean and a brush, get those all cleaned out. We want to get all the debris out of them so that way we don't have any rolled threads or anything like that on the uh, nuts or hardware, or excuse me, the bolts or hardware there. So I'll just get these clean real quick and we'll do the same on the other side. We're going to be putting the hitch up there. You may want to have a second pair of hands. It's just going to help you keep everything in place while you get the hardware set up. Uh, it is a little bit heavy and awkward. We're just going to be routing this right side up through the exhaust so that way we don't have to pull the rear fascia off or anything of the sort. Pretty easy install on this one. We'll just go ahead and slide this corner up, kind of rotating to keep it off the exhaust. We're gonna take our hardware, which is gonna be our bolt and our conical washer with teeth. We're gonna throw that right up here in our first hole. Again, this is kind of where those second pair of hands will come into play, getting this all lined up and into place. And once we start those, we'll just kind of leave them loose. That way we can get the other side and we'll repeat on the other side for the two. Now that we've got the hitch and hardware in place, one thing we're gonna make sure we do is follow the instruction guide as far as the torque spec for all these. It's very important just for the safety and longevity of this hitch and the safety of anything you might be towing or hauling on the back of the vehicle. We'll go through each one and torque to spec. That is going to be a 17 millimeter socket that we're using to torque these down with. With all four of those torqued down, that completes our install of the e-trailer hitch on our 2014 Tucson. Do appreciate you hanging out. 